We can briefly understand security groups by clicking on the security tab here. For example, we can get an overview of security groups and inbound and outbound rules attached to our instance, okay? But what I will do is access a more detailed page, which is here. Let's click on security groups from the left-hand side menu. As you can notice, we have two security groups here in our console so far. The default security group is created by default. We also have this launched wizard one security group here, which was created when we created our EC2 instance. This one, right? The security group has an ID, as you can see. This security group has an ID. This security group has an ID. And we can check its inbound rule. For example, for this security group, these are inbound rules. Port 80 and port 22 are allowed on this EC2 instance. If I click here, edit inbound rule, I can see more details. The first inbound rule here is the HTTP rule, which allows connectivity to port 80 from anywhere. The second rule is SSH which allows connectivity at port 22 from anywhere.